teaching has done more for me than I've ever could dream of doing for it because it's allowed me to search. I don't expect you to think that I have to motivate you. What I want you to do is I want you to think about uh, yourself. I want you to go back inside of yourself and listen to the voices of those other people. Those other people back when it was truth. There always comes a time when you gotta plant your feet, you gotta stand firm, and you gotta make a point. You wanna breathe? You know, those happen to be some of the last words that my father ever said to me. So definitely <laughs> made a lasting impression. Son, every now and then, somewhere, someplace, sometime, you're gonna have to plant your feet and stand firm. And make a point about who you are and what you believe in. When that time comes, Pat, you simply have to do it. He gave 110% in practice, 110% in ball games. And what Pat Riley did for basketball at our small high school, he expects his players to do the same thing. Pat was the hardest working player he had day in, day out. Uh, you know, he would come to practice and he would play to the point of exhaustion. He did it in the game, practice, wherever he played. He worked hard. I think what he believed in as a player just transcended to Pat the coach. Patience to me is a strength. And it's a stronghold. It's something that you can fall back on. And there's no doubt that, that everything good takes time. If you win 